At moments like this, it can be important to talk. Outside church on the Windsor estate, the Duke of Edinburgh's daughter-in-law, Sophie, shared details of his final moments. It was so gentle. The Counts of Wessex, Prince Edward and daughter Lady Louise had joined the Duke of York for the Sunday morning service. Prince Andrew describing how the Queen is coping. I feel very sorry um, and supportive of my mother who's um, uh, feeling it, I think, probably more than everybody else. Uh, she described uh, his passing as a miracle in the, in, and, um, uh, and she's um, contemplating, I think is the way that I would put it. There, she described it as, as, as having left a huge void. It's the first time that he's spoken since he stepped away from royal duties. So telling to hear him talk about Prince Philip's unwavering support. I loved him as a father. He was so um, calm. If you had a problem, he would think about it. Uh, and that's the, that's the great thing that I always um, think about is that he was always somebody you could go to and he would always listen. Um, so it's a great loss. I think the way I would put it is that we've lost almost the grandfather of the nation. He used to give, he used to give you like a hard time. There's a horse that shouldn't be there. <laughs> Talking to staff who work on the estate, the family swapped stories of what a character he'd been. He went carriage driving around here on a, on a regular basis, and, and but he'd go to places that you know were quite you know all over the place, and uh, so we were just talking. Oh, pulled, the, pulled out of a few ditches here, I seem to remember as well. Oh well, <laughs> the early days, yes, he used to have a few problems. No, so, uh... quite <laughs> more recently too. <laughs> the tributes have been just fantastic, and that, that's really really important, and we really do appreciate it. Last year, the Queen and Prince Philip posed outside of the same church for Princess Beatrice's wedding. Now ahead of his funeral, Windsor continues to be the focus for tributes. It is incredibly rare to hear members of the royal family speaking this personally. And I think one of the reasons they are is because they can't come out and see for themselves the flowers that people are bringing. But they do want to acknowledge just how much it means to them and also how they've been lifted by hearing those memories of Prince Philip, some that they've never even heard before. It is understood the Queen attended Mass privately inside the castle. In difficult times, the nation often turns to her for support. Now, Her Majesty and her family are finding comfort from the public as they face this moment of enormous change. Rhiannon Mills, Sky News, at Windsor Castle.